We were 10 years into not having a track. We had all our meets away. We had no practice facility. There was grass growing in the cracks. It was not a very nice place for our track team. So we decided to start a walkathon. We knew we couldn't raise enough money for a track, but we could raise awareness of what we needed. So there were many people who helped us to do that, and we raised $22,000. With that money, we bought, we bought um, hurdles for the new track, mats, everything that we need to now have track meets at Central High School. In the past, Keith Olson, Margie's Works, put in a tremendous amount of time with 100 athletes a year with no facilities. So I'd personally like to thank them for all their time and effort, and we wonder what we could have done with the right facilities. But thank you to them. Now for the people who donated to the track walkathon, first of all, Hank Billingsley, he was the first one to turn in a check and say we want to help and donate to the community. So Billingsley Engineering. <laughs> Brass Bowl Mobile and Edenhofer's Law Office. We had our walkathon, they donated prizes, food, they've done a lot for our community. Proforma, Mr. Mike Cassidy, they've donated t-shirts for our freshman mentors. All through our walkathon, they donated everything that we had. Sport Physical Therapy, they donated a trainer for us to use, Jan Orris here, and much, many different items for our walkathon also. There's a plaque here for Subway too, Chris, remember? Where's Subway? There you go.